This lesson is based on some videos created by pupils at Richard Lander School down in Cornwall who thought about how we can be a good friend and what are the things that we can say or do and what are the things we should avoid saying or doing in order to be a kind friend. The Richard Lander pupils looked at three different scenarios. The first one was if we're feeling lonely or left out. Then they thought about what about times when we need a bit of space to think. And the third was how a friend responds when we open up to them about something that's going on for us. You're going to watch each of the videos that the Richard Lander pupils made and you're going to see, first of all, how we might get it wrong. Then you'll have a chance to talk about what maybe we could do differently. And then you'll see what the Richard Lander pupils thought might be a better way of doing things and you'll have a chance to discuss that too. The first scenario that the Richard Lander pupils looked at was what about when someone is feeling lonely or left out? Let's watch the video and see how not to do it first of all. It's not nice to feel left out. Think of yourself in their position. What do you think about this situation? Can you imagine it happening? Perhaps you've either been the person who's lonely or left out, or you've been one of the friends. What do you think might be a different way that this could have happened? What would have been a kinder response? Now let's see what the Richard Lander pupils thought might have been a better way for this situation to have played out. The next situation that the Richard Lander pupils looked at was when somebody feels like they need a bit of space to themselves to think through things that might be on their mind. Let's have a look at what Richard Lander pupils thought was how not to get this right. Hey Ebony, what's wrong? I don't really want to talk about it. Well, why not? I just can't talk about it, please leave me alone. You can't just sit there looking miserable and doing nothing. You're such an attention seeker. <laughs> yeah, attention seeker. It's up to the individual if they want to talk or not. What do you think about this clip? How could things have played differently? What might have been a kinder response? Now, let's see what the Richard Lander pupils thought would have been a better way for this situation to have been handled. Hey, Ebony, what's wrong? I don't really want to talk about it. That's okay, we're always here if you need us. Sometimes that's all you need to hear. The third scenario was one in which a young person opened up to a friend about something that was going on for them. Let's see first what the Richard Lander pupils thought was not the best way to manage this situation. Hey, what's wrong? I'm just a bit nervous. I get anxious quite a lot. Oh, I get anxious all the time. What do you think were the problems with the way that the friend responded here? What do you think might have been a better response? And here's what the Richard Lander pupils thought. Sometimes you don't want your friends to try and relate, you just want them to say that it's okay. Finally, have a think in your pairs or groups or on your own if you're watching this at home about what you think make a good friend. What would be your top tips of how to be a good friend? And what would be the things that we should avoid? I hope you found this lesson useful and that it gave you some things to think about, about how to be a good friend and what to avoid. A huge thanks to the pupils at Richard Lander School in Cornwall and to the Head Start Kerno project who funded the filming.